Our, our guests in the studio might mm -hmm. have the answers that you're looking for. Good morning to Professor Dr. Muhammad. That's um, right. You know, the, the, thing is, the thing about change is that, you know, we're talking about the power of paradigm today. Change is, I mean, change, it's, it's changeable, right? Permanent. But it's why, why is it so hard for some people? <laughs> to change. Actually, you must say, change is permanent. <laughs> we always have change because yep. uh, the skin that we have now mm -hmm. was not there seven years ago. Oh, yeah. So change is permanent. <laughs> uh -huh. But personal growth is a choice, mm -hmm. okay? So, we are talking about paradigm today. We have to know what's a paradigm. When mm -hmm. we say paradigm, what we mean is a multitude of actions and habits. Mm -hmm. So, paradigm explains why we talk the way we do, why we think the way we think, why we feel the way we feel. And mm -hmm. paradigm determines everything. Mm -hmm. It determines your health status. It determines your intelligence, how you interact with people, emotional intelligence. Mm -hmm. It determines your relationship with people. Mm -hmm. It determines your connection to the <coughs> God Almighty. And it determines your financial status. Uh -huh. So we find that some people, you can have the same family, uh, two brothers and sisters maybe, brought up by the same family with the same food, the same school they go, but they become differently in years mm. to come. Mm -hmm. Why? It has to do with what I call blueprint. Mm. Mm -hmm. All of us have a blueprint, okay? Like say you have a computer, mm -hmm. you have a, the hard disk, what software are you adding? If you put a PowerPoint, your keynote, that determines. So all of us are being programmed. Mm -hmm. So like Zaleha said, <coughs> some people they wake up, oh, I'm in, I, I'm in a rut. Life is a matter of the meaning you give to what happened to you, your interpretation of things. Mm -hmm. So some people this morning, I always say, uh, when I see a patient, if I tell them they have a problem, I say you have two choices. Uh -huh. You can choose to suffer or you can choose to heal. Uh -huh. Up to you. Because mm -hmm. your mind will affect your physiology. Again and again, I say positive psychology, positive psych uh, physiology. Mm -hmm. So if you want to know a person's future, all of us, I'm telling myself to look at our status of Facebook today. <laughs> if we are putting YouTube on some, appreciating someone uh -huh. good, a good cause or something good. But if you are putting on YouTube, oh, I'm being awful today, so I'm, I'm a victim today. Because you see, the, uh, uh, just like uh, success leave clues, failures leave clues. You want to know failures or success first? Let's look at failures. Okay. Uh -huh. Failures always complain. Uh -huh. Failures always blame. <coughs> They blame the, the economy, they blame the family, they blame the parents, they blame the teachers. And failures always take shame. They say, oh, I'm no good. Listen to the self-talk you have to yourself today. If you say, oh, I'm awful, I'm terrible, all oh, these pimple is coming out. <laughs> these are the failures. These are the people, I will say, in life, we have a river of life. Uh -huh. You see a river of life at the top, all the fresh water. Nice. Correct, correct. But below is all the clutter, you know, all the mud. The debris. So yeah, which but, are you? Uh -huh. If you are going to have a very negative mindset, always looking for your glasses that you wear, looking what's wrong today. Oh, if I see this person, oh, what's wrong on the news? Oh, who's, who's getting divorced? Who's getting killed? Who's being raped? Who's wow. in the video? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> who's in the video? Whereas winners, okay, winners, you want to know if you are a winner or not? Look at how you look at things. Mm -hmm. Success is not people who bring more money, but people who bring success in everything they do. So successful people, if they have something negative, they say, what can I learn from this? Mm -hmm. If non-successful, they say, oh, poor me. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm the victim. Ah. Okay, so successful people are bigger than the problem. Uh, non-successful people are so uh, small, the problem is bigger than them. So they feel that, they say, I'm in a rut. Mm -hmm. So they cannot see anything else. Mm -hmm. For example, they have one, let's say, a person who go and criticize them or who are not nicely to them. So they allow something that happened outside to determine their life. Uh -huh. For example, they said, uh, okay, uh, today I'm in a bad mood because I'm working a shift rotation with this person whom I don't like. Or they go to the office, they're all happy and was told off by the boss. Mm. Always spoil their days. Oh, that means you have given your life to that person. Uh -huh. So, you see, it's very, very important. And I'm seeing this all the time. I've been a doctor for so long. <laughs> when I do listen on patient, the minute they come, I'm scared, doctor. But one person says, oh, doctor, I'm having my dream come true. So the way they behave, essentially, is the same procedure they're going to have. Mm. But most of them, after they even, oh, is that all? Oh, my God, I'm so glad I did it. But, you know, again, so I said, you know what, when uh, uh, the way you choose to process events, that is your life. Mm -hmm. So paradigm <coughs> is something that is programmed in us. And mm -hmm. I told before, we have two kinds of mind, the conscious mind, the subconscious mind. Mm -hmm. When you say the conscious mind is only determ determining only 5% of our achievement, but our subconscious mind, our programming, that's the one that is going to determine 95% of our health, 
wealth, prosperity, and joy. Mm -hmm. So we have to, the media especially is very important. What the media is showing, same. Sometimes, uh, I'm not being critical, but I think we have to look at a more mature picture. I hope everyone who's being told, even me, mm -hmm. we like to have feedback. Mm -hmm. See, if you look at our form, we are a spiritual being having a human experience mm -hmm. or a human being having an occasional spiritual experience. Mm -hmm. Most people, they are, believe they're only human, they only see what they see mm -hmm. and they go once in a while for the Muslim, they go to Umrah, they go to there, they become spiritual for this two weeks moment. <laughs> After they become bad again, uh -huh. okay, they thought that God is only in Mecca, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Number two is people who say, I'm spiritual, mm. but I'm having human experience. I have to drink, I have to breathe, but basically, in essence, I'm spiritual. So when we look at the mirror, are we the person who is looking at the mirror or being looked at? If we say we are being looked at, we are physical. Actually, 99% is spiritual because we can still remember who we were 10 years ago when we were 4 years old, 9 years old. We can remember, but the physical body that we have was not here 7 years ago. Mm. So in other words, only 1% of us is what we see but many a time the media or everywhere we're concentrating on the physical okay the kind of uh, you know whatever hairstyle and all that can mm -hmm. but the whole the whole passion and mm -hmm. purpose of living is it just for the look your purpose in life so you must have happiness fulfillment and purpose in life and if we do not have inner peace mm -hmm. and joy we have nothing because our life happiness is not about what we acquire outside but who we become in acquiring. In other words, success is not what you acquire, mm -hmm. but who you become when you achieve that level. So this is something, vitamins for the mind, I want to tell everyone in Malaysia, including myself and my family, mm -hmm. start seeing the focus in your life. Are you doing something for achievement, for ambition, or are you doing something for meaning? Mm -hmm. so ensure every step, every person we meet, every deeds that we do, everything that we write on Facebook, Twitter, paper, the journalist, storyline, the movie directors, the film that you make, what is that for? Is it for just getting awards or for something that is going to have meaningful impact on all the young minds that is growing now? And we know that we parents and adults now, what we don't fix now, our children will inherit. Mm -hmm. So if we don't fix the way of thinking, that's mm -hmm. only just materialistic, hedonism, excessive uh, uh, entertainment, mm -hmm. rather than personal development, increasing yourself, your inner self, and live from in and out, mm -hmm. then we're going to have a world of full of materialism, but full of sadness and no inner peace in everyone. Mm -hmm. Look at around us. You look at around us, we can tell. Mm -hmm. That's why I said I've been a doctor for so long. The way a person speaks, you can predict the health in 15 years time. Oh. Wow. When you see the person answer the phone, how they answer the phone, how they meet you, you know how they are already. Oh, okay. Yes, we don't have to go to a fortune teller. Just see the way a person speaks because mm -hmm. the ancestor to every action is your thought. And the only thing you can control mm -hmm. that others cannot control is your thinking. Mm -hmm. And what we think about expand. So if you only choose to complain, mm -hmm. you are focusing on negative, more negative. Negativity. But if you want to choose gratefulness, on the good, mm -hmm. more gratefulness will come. Uh -huh. More good things will come. So right. it's so easy. But before yeah. we let you off now, yeah. Yeah. Um, what kind of check, how, how do you do the check and balance? You know, I mean, you, you want to incite change and everything. Yes. You know, you've got your plan ready, but there will be time when, you know, you will have to, you know, sit back and... Very good word. You just say a keyword. It's good to have a plan, but it's neurotic to fall in love with your plan. <laughs> you know, neurotic will say this. If only you are like me, I wish I had done that. That's neurotic. And neurotics look for problem. But no limit person look for the solution. We want to become no limit person, Zariha. Mm -hmm. And I tell everyone today, let's have a script with uh, our uh, bathroom mirror. All right. Today, nobody is going to spoil my day by negative things. Mm -hmm. Not even the person looking at this mirror. Today, I expect this to happen see what you expect to happen because when you desire something that means you expect and to expect means you achieve mm -hmm. so only expect miracles and unfolding of god's power in yourself and everyone today all right mm, thank beautiful. you very much mm -mm. Mm -hmm. thank you prof thank you. what a great way to start the morning well, right um, what it means for the mind of mm -hmm. course, you know, you can actually choose to heal or choose to suffer. suffer. Or choose to just to complain. <laughs> yeah, complain. <laughs> Thank yeah. you very much. Thank you.